barefaced audacity. What led you to be so vindictive against your own brother? I'm bowled over. Well, Ted, I would say this is something approaching the naked truth, isn't it? It's a real cards on the table stunt. I mean, we're in the land of no holds barred now. I mean, how else can you interpret it? To pinch your younger brother's specially made cheese roll when he's out doing a spot of work, that's not equivocal, it's unequivocal. Mind you, Ted, I will say you do seem to have grown a bit sulky over the last few years, a bit sulky, a bit, you know, a bit less forthcoming. It's funny because because I'd have thought in the United States of America, I mean with the sun and all that, the open spaces on the old campus, in your position, lecturing on the old campus, in the center of all the intellectual life out there, all the social world, all the, all the stimulation of it all, all your kids and all that to have fun with down by the pool, all the Greyhound buses and all that, Tons of iced water, all the comfort of those Bermuda shorts and all that. No time of the day or night you can't get a cup of coffee or a Dutch gin. I'd have thought you'd have grown to be more forthcoming, not less. Because I want you to know you set a standard for us, Teddy. Your family looks up to you and boy, you know what it does. It does its best to follow the example you set because you're a great source of pride to us. That's why we're so glad to welcome you back, to welcome you back to your birthplace, that's why. Now listen, Ted. There's no question that we live a less rich life here than you do over there, but we live a closer life. We're busy, of course. Joey's busy with his boxing. I am busy with my occupation. Dad still plays a good game of poker and does the cooking as well. Well, up to his old standard. And Uncle Sam is the best chauffeur in the firm. But nevertheless, we do make up a unit, Teddy, and you're an integral part of it. When we sit round the backyard having a quiet gander at the nice guy, there's always an empty chair standing in the circle, which is in fact your. And so, when you at length return to us, we do expect a bit of grace, a bit of je ne sais quoi, a bit of generosity of mind, a little liberality of spirit to reassure us. We do expect that. But do we get it? Have we got it? Is that what you've given us? <laughs>